We all know that NASCAR 21 Ignition is finally out, and we all know as well that it sucks. So, you guys know we are on NASCAR Heat 5 right now, and we are going to be starting a brand new season. And so, for our driver, we selected John Hunter Nemechek. I know he's not in the Cup Series this year, but I think it would be cool to kind of use him as a driver. And uh, we got 26 laps at Daytona International Speedway for the Daytona 500. Alright, so what we are going to do is we are going to skip the practice and go on to qualify. Qualifying it starts right now. Um, we get two laps to qualify. Hopefully, we get the pole position. That would be really cool. You know, our first race of the season, and uh, we get the pole. I think that'd be pretty sick if that happened. But I don't think that's gonna happen if we hit the wall. Okay, Alrighty, guys. So we have the pole. So, we are going to end this qualify. We're going to qualify with that. Um, wow. That's actually pretty impressive. I'm not going to lie. Green flag is out here at Daytona for the Daytona 500. We got 14 laps. And uh, let's hope that this goes well. I hit the wall. We hit the wall already. Um, we're gonna have a little bit of battle with Ty Dillon, and he's gonna not take the lead away. Thought for a second he was gonna take the lead away, and we keep bouncing. Well, if we keep bouncing off the wall like that, then uh, well, we will be the lead will be taken away from us. I feel like it'd be really cool if, like, you know, we win. The Daytona 500, um, I think that'd be really cool because, like, John Hunter Nemechek did not win any races when he was in the Cup Series, so, you know, we're kind of doing this for Nemechek, Nemechek, John Hunter Nemechek, so that way there he can, uh, pretty much, he can look back on this and be like, yeah, that's how my rookie year could have went, but instead... It went like it did IRL. Car feels really smooth. Um, I don't really have too many complaints or uh, really anything. Um, no complaints. Cars looking pretty good right now, so we are we are good to go. We have a seven-second lead on a Ty Dillon and. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you guys, that's pretty impressive because I was not expecting us to, I was not expecting us to qualify this good. I was thinking like a 20th place qualify or something like that. I did not think that we were going to qualify this good and be this dominant in the race. Michael McDowell is now in second place. Um, you never know, we could relive history and Michael McDowell could win the Daytona 500. Um, cause, you know, he did win the 2021 Daytona 500, but technically, this is going to be the 2022 Daytona 500, but uh, we won't talk about that. We are down to less than five laps to go here at Daytona International Speedway, and I'm not going to lie to you guys, I think we might be lapping some people if we don't hit the wall um there's a very good possibility that we could that we've ran this race completely green there's been no cautions very surprising but if we get a caution right now i don't think we will have a chance at really winning this race i don't know um just because the damage that we have who knows what all the other drivers have for damage as well you never know they could have a lot more damage than I do, but I don't really have that much damage at all. White flag presented by Credit One Bank here at Daytona International Speedway. 
I think we might even be able to lap some cars here. This should be really good. Um, I don't... By the looks of it, I don't know. I can see some cars going off to the turn right now. There could... There is a good possibility that we can lap maybe one or two cars, but I don't see it happening, to be honest with you guys. For the final time, coming off turn three and four onto the front straightaway. Wow, guys, we won the Daytona 500. That's pretty, <laughs> that's a pretty good race. Not gonna lie, that was really, really good. Point standings, one win, so I'm pretty sure that means we are locked into the playoffs. Hey right, guys, that's gonna be it for today's video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends if you enjoyed it, and if you're interested in getting a gaming computer, click the link in the description below this video. Apex Gaming PC is absolutely fantastic computers, and if you use code SQUAD, S-Q-U-A-D, you guys can get 10% off. Yes, you heard that right, 10% off. Peace out, and I will see you guys in the next one. Yee-yee.